This is 2668, 2668 Connecticut. I apologize. Now it's rainy and gloomy out here, guys. So I uh, apologize for any mud or something. I'll get it cleaned up. I already walked through here, so it's a little bit muddy. Now, after I took the pictures, the best I could without dirtying the floor. I buried the back room the most, so just pretend you don't see it. <laughs> okay, so you walk in, this is your open-ended kitchen and dining. This is a three bedroom, one bath slab. With all high-end finishes, everything's new in here. So, here's your kitchen setup. Uh, stove goes here. Just to put on the light so it looks better. Stove goes here. Fridge goes there. LVP flows into the dining. There's a divider if you needed one. You can put a table for four, a table for six. Obviously, when you're not using the you know, the, the, the fifth and sixth, you would slide it back and you know what I'm saying? Or if you turned it the other way, you would have this whole lane of openness, turn it this way and boom. Then you have the living room area. So nice, open, convenient, attractive. Rehab looks new, looks good. This is going to be the bathroom. Everything's new here too. The whole place is new, okay? So everything you're looking at is new. I walked through it. It's a little bit dusty and stuff because I was looking at everything, climbing everywhere, looking everywhere. So I apologize for that, but I'll have them come clean it after it stops raining. I think it's gonna rain for the next couple of days. So maybe sometime in the next day or two, I'll have them come clean it. So here's your bathroom. Uh, let's start with bedroom. Oh, well, let's do this. This is your utility room. There's your back door. Uh, you do have a, a yard and a shed in, in the yard. Um, this is a utility room or a multi-purpose room. Depends on your vision, right? Here's your laundry hookups. There's your utility stuff. There's everything you need. So everything looks good. So... This we'll call the master because there's actually two closets available for it. Here's his closet just outside the room so that, uh, you know, she can have the whole closet inside. <laughs> here's bedroom number one, one of three. This is going to be uh, a, a 10 by 12 or an 11 by 12. I think it's 11 by 12. And this is her closet. Nice, nice, deep for the shoe rack, shelves for scarves, and there's your stuff. If, if you really wanted to, you probably can hang another pole here and have a dual thing. It all depends on what you're trying to do. I don't know how much stuff you got. So you walk this way, it's gonna be bedroom number two. All the bedrooms have closets, they're all legit. They're all good sizes. So this one's gonna be uh, a 10 by 11. The other one's gonna be a little bit bigger all the way around. This is still a big, excuse me, this is still a big room. Um, you can fit any size bed in these rooms and all three of them. Uh, here's your closet. Everything's new, everything matches, everything's painted. Everything's fresh, it's a clean, clean. Walk this way, you still got the plastic on the cabinets. That's how new they are. You got all the plastics on them still. And then here finally is bedroom number three. This one's gonna be 11 by 11, a little more square. I'm telling you, I think the middle one's 11 too. I think they're all 11 this way, and then this one's 10, the next one's 11, and the last one's 12. Cause the last one was the longest one, right? So that's what I'm thinking. Like a one foot difference in each room, but they're all big enough to fit a queen size bed and uh, and more, you know, depending on what you're trying to accomplish. Everything's new, everything's good, plenty of plugs. 
everything's good. So, nice quiet area. You do have one or two off street parking in the back, but you know, respectfully, there's a shed there, so don't go past the shed, right? You wanna make sure you're not driving all up to the back door, cause you know, you're responsible for the lawn and the conditioning of it, you know? So, come get it, guys, come get it. Oh, option, $100 more a month for your stove.